So this is the engineering precinct and it's going to be used for sciences and engineering and woods and automotives and all that. It's very new and um, modern. I think it's really exciting being the first to use it. So we started master planning in 2010 and we wanted to think differently about teaching and learning in our school and what were the opportunities. I guess when we're building a building we don't want to build it for the next five years, we're thinking about the next 50 and so we wanted to create spaces which were quite flexible for both teaching and learning and the engineering precinct allows us to put physics, chemistry, automotive, engineering, woodwork alongside maths and English and humanities and allow us to look at curriculum not just as a topic or a subject in a a block but how each of the different aspects integrate and, and influence each other. I think one of the, the great things about this facility is it allows students who are doing completely different subjects witnessing what might be happening in automotive uh, or science. It's really good how it's so open and you can like see all the classrooms and things going on. Classrooms used to be built as square boxes and one of the things I love about these classrooms is they're not square boxes and they're not the same. Each classroom has something a bit special. Some are small, some are medium sized, some are large. In the building area we've actually got more room to build what we need to. So yeah, I, I really do like it. This community, our young people and their teachers deserve the most contemporary setting and those up-to-date facilities. The school is 127 years old. The history of education in Castlemaine is, is long and rich and so these buildings ensure that the community gets the current learning environments and up-to-date, which means that kids' learning is, is expanded into future opportunities.